Jennifer Henson Decker. I'm from District 58, which at this point is Shelby County. Actually, I've had a kind of a varied career. I, um, I'm, a, I'm an attorney. I practiced law for about 20 years in the federal tax courts. So I studied tax law and uh, just loved that. But I had two small children. And when they, I thought when they were first born, I thought as they got older, I would work more. But as it happened, as they got older, I tended to think I needed to work less. So I quit at one after about 20 years. And I still practiced law, did a lot of pro bono work and represented friends and actually people who couldn't afford a lawyer. That That's pretty much who I represented for a long time and nonprofits and then when my children graduated and went away um, the first the next job I took is I worked for Senator Rand Paul for five years and then um, a nonprofit that I was on the board f with had an opening for executive director Christian nonprofit and I went there and have been there for the past five years still practicing law and uh, doing a lot of work that I feel is important. Well, I've always had a great interest in the legislative matters. Um, actually, when I was in law school and I started reading cases on the Constitution, it just intrigued me and um, I have such a respect for the Constitution, both of Kentucky and the United States, the way they separate powers. Um, the, the purpose is to m make people more free government smaller, uh, less intrusive, and I just have been interested in government ever since I studied that and want to protect our constitutions, and uh, I'm interested in good government. Of course, I, I think life is sacred, and I, I hope to protect life. Um, I believe in religious freedom, and um, I think it is always in peril, and individual freedom. Is, is always in peril. So I hope to um, support bills that both foster those principles and to try to stop bills that don't. Well, I think we have to keep people safe and I think the rules that have been put in place, I think we're with good motives, but I think we've uh, the government has overreached and uh, I feel as though the role of government is to give the information people need to make good decisions and then to set uh, rules that people can abide by and not lose their property, not uh, lose their you know, lose their way to maintain their families. Uh, I'd like to see us safely reopen our economy, uh, allow our children to go back to school, and to enjoy uh, freedom with um, with the common sense we all have. I remember um, one day someone wrote to me. I did not know the person and. They wrote and said, we the people are depending on you. That is a, a real responsibility and a great honor that I take seriously. Um, I think it is just a, an exciting adventure. Uh, I like challenges. I like to learn. Um, and I'm looking forward to having a voice in matters that are important and being able to work for people. Um, as, an ad, as a lawyer, I've always advocated for people, so it's not an unusual role and it's one I enjoy. I've seen what it's like to be in public office but not in public office. Uh, I've seen the commitment it takes. Um, I think Senator Paul was a great role model in that he, I think he's a statesman and he taught me um, a very important lesson which is to work with people who have common goals. So um, I, I do think we have a very toxic environment in politics but I have admired Senator Paul and how he will reach across the aisle to work with people. Maybe he doesn't agree with 99 out of 100 things, but he will work on that one thing. So I look forward to working with people who have different ideas. I like to hear them. I want to come to some solutions that maybe are thinking all the way out of the box.